So you have eight and four in both hands. Yes, it might be a little too similar, you see, because it's good to have a, a different pitch. And the flute harmonic, I think for me, is a little too heavy. Okay. Maybe it would be better to have the flute conic than the flute harmonic of the great hue. Because the flute harmonic is very thick. Okay. So let's play with the flute conic. And Bordeaux and Preston, that's not bad. Yeah, yeah. So you, we have a flute. And now for the pedal. That's always the trouble with the pedal. Yes, <laughs> it's either too lo loud or too soft. Mm -hmm. The mode, I am afraid, is much too loud. Oh, yeah. So I should take the bottom eight. And why not try to have something in the swell division to reinforce it? The gamba, for instance, that gives a little the sound of a cello. And that helps to give him accuracy to the pedal because you see if you take the mode it's much too loud so we should try to imitate the cello as much as we can and it's why very often i take some gambas for imitating the bowing of the cello let's go <laughs> parallel octaves, but never rise parallel octaves. <laughs> yeah, want <laughs> singing style you see so in between each phrase just give me your place mm. just for a moment Goethe Jesu Goethe but Greece you have some the line you can breathe and show that now comes the next phrase if you have to sing it you would have to breathe otherwise you would be voiceless and it will be just the same thing there right. and there after each matter, breathe because there is no other verse no other phrase of the poetry so let's begin again yeah yeah Marie Claremont is known as a Bach scholar, with publications in several languages. In 1968, a volume on the organ works of J.S. Bach was issued by Costellar Editions to accompany the LP recordings which Madame Alain had recorded for Erato. It includes photos of her 1959 recording sessions in Denmark with the recording engineers and Anton Heiler. 
This recording project of the complete organ works of Bach lasted seven years. In the United States, these Bach records were released through the Musical Heritage Society in the late 1960s. Madame Alain has since recorded the complete organ works of Bach twice more, each time for Erato. The fantasy you've been hearing is from her 1983 recording on Erato CD number 88004.
Mercy. The first note should be a letter at Mercy. <laughs> It must not be a regular, not at all. We are in the 19th century again. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, take your time and uh, give importance to the notes you feel must be emphasized as you would do at the piano. Yeah, again. <laughs> I know you miss the acoustics that we have in France. Da -de -da, but let it go. And da -de -da. And now comes the other Joe. <laughs> Vermont. There are just a few things that I want to show <laughs> ask you. I, yeah, I was not agreeing totally with your beginning. <laughs> you see, I find it much too regular. It's, uh, of course, a toccata style, but it has been the style of an improvisation. <laughs> <laughs> Take your time, and you have to push two pedals. Ange cantog, ange pedal. So, take your time. All the rest was very, very good. <laughs> what a beautiful performance! But uh, you see, uh, don't be afraid of showing your musicianship. <laughs> yes, <laughs> absolutely. Thank you. Thank you.